Welcome back to Let's Go Eevee. We have just arrived at the Viridian City Gym Leader, the final Gym Leader of the game as well, because then we're going to be moving on to the Pokemon League. So I'm really excited about this. Looks like we're in for another battle. I think we're making some good progress. Once we've done this one, can't we just go through the door? I don't know if we'll just like keep spinning past. I don't know. We'll just have to see, I guess. A truly strong trainer wins with style. This is an ace trainer as well, so... I'm kind of a little bit worried about what levels her Pokemon are going to be. She's an ace trainer, Kelly, but we will see how this goes. Anido Queen. All right, let's see what we can do against this little rascal here. I wonder how much damage our Blastoise would do. Our little bubbles. Let's see how we can, how well we will do against this. Let's do a Mega Evolution and then we'll do Surf as always because this seems to be like an amazing strategy to, you know, take down the Pokemon in this area. I love seeing the Mega Evolutions as well. It's just so cool. The novelty of it hasn't worn off. Not yet anyway. I'm sure it will, but <laughs> I'm sure I'll get sick of seeing the transformation. Like I bet it gets a bit annoying having to see it every time. It's kind of short though, so I guess it's not too bad. Wow, it actually survived. I think this is the first time anything has survived an attack from my Mega Evolution, so I'm pretty surprised at that. Okay, let's bite it, finish it off, and maybe we can go into that dark kind of spooky looking room and see if we can like challenge the trainer there. I lost my grip. You definitely lost something. I'm not sure if it was your grip, but you lost something. The gym leader will scold me for losing this way. Do you think so? Well, only one way to find out. Am I going to be able to? Oh, no, look, I'll go right past it. What a tease. Oh, <laughs> but it's right there. <laughs> Savage! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> you must be running out of steam by now. No, I haven't even begun. What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm just getting started. Yuji. Okay, he's got two Pokemon. Let's see what he's got. A Dug Trio. That should be pretty easy. You know what? I'm not even going to Mega Evolve with this one because I really, I feel quite confident that we're going to take out of one shot without even having to Mega Evolve because I don't think that these Dug Trios are that difficult to take down so I'm sure we'll be fine come on my bubbles we got this I'll be really surprised if they live I'm gonna be gutted if they live now okay there we go we managed to take them down so that's what matters okay what else has he got he's got another one of those and it's gonna be an easy one to beat okay a Rhyhorn I am confident that we don't need to mega evolve for this one as well just to save us like an extra minute of time I guess you could say so we can get more done in the episode that is the plan all right go 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 yeah, there we go. See, we saved a, like a, a whole minute of time right there. <laughs> a whole minute of my life was saved. <laughs> I ran out of gas. Oh, dude, it was you who was running out of steam, not me. You tried to blame it on me. I found a revive, nice, but that didn't go anywhere. Like, I've gone back to the beginning again, right? Yeah, ah. Uh, so how am I meant to proceed in this area? Because I'm actually not really sure, to be honest with you. If I go that way, I'm just going to end up going back around down that corner again. Hmm, interesting. It's got to be, I've got to try and find a way onto those blue parts. How do I go onto those blue bits though? I don't know, because that stupid guy's blocking the way as well. Wait, if I do this, wait a second. Can I like squidge onto the blue one? I don't really know. Like, how am I meant to do this? I'm just going to end up going back around in the same, same direction again. That's very strange. Dude, can you move out my way? <laughs> You're in my way. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I don't know where to go. I'm lost a little bit here. What about if I try to go to the left? Go here. I stop here. And then what? Oh, hold on. I know. I know. And then here. And then I can go on the blue bits. I didn't see this bit before. Okay, awesome. And then I have to fight at least one of these, I believe, I think. Okay, so if I do this, hold on, let me check my Pokemon. Uh, Bubbles is a little bit low. I could probably get like a few more Pokemon down with Bubbles. I think we'll be okay for a bit. Pokemon and I, we make wonderful music together. You're a musician? I thought you were a tamer. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're getting your roles muddled up. Jason. See, he's a tamer. What? What's up with that? That's really weird. Okay, he only has one Pokemon, but that's okay too. Go, Bubbles. We can do it. Let's go. Let's 
defeat him once and for all. I don't think we need to Omega Evolve, we should be fine. Let's do this. Maybe I should go to a Pokemon Center before we start this and get Bubbles full life. That probably would be a really good idea, actually. Okay, there we go. You are in perfect harmony. I am? That's good. <laughs> You strange person. Do you know the identity of our gym leader? No, I don't actually. All right, so if we go here, I could go straight into, oh, we've revealed it. Oh my God, he's the leader of Team Rocket, right? I'm pretty sure he's the leader of Team Rocket. What are you doing here? Oh, that would be uh, that would be why the gym was closed. He was too busy trying to take over Silphco. <laughs> That's why he wasn't there probably. <laughs> I see, I understand now. Okay, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center just before we do this. I've beat that gym leader like three times already. What makes the game think that I'm not gonna be able to do it a third time? Why do I have to beat the same person three times? <laughs> it's kind of a little bit underwhelming, you know, that it's the same guy. Because that doesn't really feel like a formidable opponent to me. Maybe that's just me. Like, I already know what one of his Pokemon's gonna be. It's 100% gonna be a Persian. So I know that bit, at least. All right, let's go back and see if we can challenge this guy then. Let's get this over with. Let's get our last gym badge. So exciting. I can't believe we've done this already. It's come up so fast and it's just so awesome to see. It's, it's going to be so awesome. I'm so excited. I can't wait. I'm going the wrong way because I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, here we go. I am back. I mean business this time, dude. I'm going to save it before we start this. Look at all our gym badges. Doesn't that just look so fantastic? It looks so awesome. It looks so good. Can I take some fruit? I want to take your fruit. <laughs> okay, let's do this. The last gym leader, guys. Let's go. Awesome. There he is. He looks evil. Oh my gosh. You evil dude. Why did they make a villain a gym leader? <laughs> Welcome to my hideout. It shall be so until I can restore Team Rocket to its former glory. I am evil, <laughs> but you have found me again. So be it. This time, I am not holding back. You were holding back before? Once more then. I look so evil. You shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. You are not the greatest trainer. I've already faced you like three times and you've lost each time. Like, come on. <laughs> You are such a sore loser. He's got four Pokemon. Okay, this is where he brings out like a level 70. I'll be like, ah! I would be like cowering behind in the corner. <laughs> I would be like, I'm sorry, please forgive me. <laughs> level 49. Nice! That's not too bad. I wonder if I'm going to be able to do this without Mega Evolving. I probably should have Mega Evolved, to be quite honest with you. I don't even know if this is going to work, but we will soon see, I guess. Oh, so close as well. Damn it. All right, we're going to do a Mega Evolution, and then I'm going to bite him. All right, there we go. Mega Evolution. I wonder if this does anything to the damage that you take. I wonder if you receive less damage if you transform into your like Mega Evolution. I don't know. I'm not sure. Oh, that was not bad though. I might use a potion on my bubbles though, just to make him last a bit longer because he's like really strong in here. So it might be a good idea. Okay, Nido King. We're going to keep battling and then I'm going to use a potion on my Pokemon here. So let's go into my bag. This lasts like the whole battle as well, like this Mega Revolution. That is so OP. All right, there we go. Hyper Potion. I have a feeling that's not actually going to fill me to full though, unfortunately. Not quite. Almost. That wasn't bad though, I have to say. All right, there we go. It doesn't really hurt that much anymore. It must do. The Mega Evolutions must help you with your defense too, because I was taking way more damage before a Mega Revolve. So that's really cool. I kind of feel, I really do feel like it's cheating a little bit though. <laughs> I feel like really OP when I use these things. <laughs> okay, it's nearly dead so I might as well just bite it to finish it off here. All right, there we go. Awesome, he fainted, sweet. All right, next Pokemon, let's do this. We are on a roll. All right, what's he got next? A Rhydon, yeah, I'm gonna keep battling. When the Persian comes out, I might switch because I don't really know if Bubbles is really going to be that effective. But yeah, we're gonna we'll definitely switch on that one. I don't know if this is going to kill it, actually, because this is the evolved form of... Oh, it did. It did. Okay, that's cool. That actually looks really cool in like its full form, like the final evolution of it. That is actually looks really cool, actually. I like that. Nido Queen, where's your Persian? What? What? You, you didn't use your Persian? 
I am just like really baffled right now. Like what? <laughs> Are we gonna kill all of his Pokemon with just bubbles? <laughs> I feel like I've cheated. <laughs> like what just happened? Bubbles is so OP. This is meant to be the, the hardest gym leader and we just wiped it out with one Pokemon. <laughs> like what just happened? <laughs> that was so easy. That wasn't the hardest gym leader. I feel cheated. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> wow. Yeah! That was truly an intense fight. We beat you for the fourth time. My god, you have to give up now. You gotta give me a gym badge now. Yet again, I am defeated. As proof of your victory, here is your earth badge. Yeah! Guys, we got all eight gym badges. How awesome is that? Yay! An earth badge makes all Pokemon obey you. Obey me, Pokemon, for I am the Pokemon master. <laughs> Regardless of how high their level is or who originally caught them, it is proof of your mastery as a Pokemon trainer. With it, you can challenge the Pokemon League. And this TM, a gift for a trainer who dares take on the challenge of the Pokemon League. Earthquake, awesome, I can't wait, I can't wait to try it. Contains Earthquake, it's a powerful attack that causes a massive tremor to deal damage to opponents. Awesome. I made it a very long time ago, back when I ran this gym far too long ago. Okay. I can't face my followers after being defeated like this. Team Rocket is, as of today, Team Rocket is finished. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Finally, as for myself, I shall dedicate my life to Pokemon training again. Oh, he's out on a mission. Wouldn't it be awesome if he, like, reappeared one day? Let us meet again someday. Farewell. Like, if he reappeared in a Pokemon game, like, down the line somewhere, that would be really cool to see him again. He's, so, I don't know, he's quite a character, isn't he? He's kind of a little bit annoying, but I don't know, he's kind of, like, likeable in a way as well. Okay, so now that we've done that, I guess our next step would actually be to do the Pokemon League, which I'm really excited about. But, yeah, we will see. I think that I might struggle with it at first, but I guess we'll see. Congrats, kid. Boy, though, what a shock. I never thought a criminal would use a Pokemon gym as their hideout. I know, right? Like, how does that even... Why did that happen? I don't know. <laughs> That's it. I've decided. I'll look after the Viridian City gym from now on. I don't really like to get tied down, so I've always said no when they ask about it, but I'm finally ready. I'll be the gym leader from now on. Oh, really? Oh, cool. That's great. Thanks. With an awesome trainer like me around, I'm pretty sure the Kanto region will be safe from troublemakers like Team Rocket forever. I hope so. So then, Miss Nintendo, time for you to take on the Pokemon League. Just keep going to the west of here and you won't miss it. The Elite Four are tough opponents, but don't you dare lose. I will not lose. We will conquer it. Awesome. The first challenger I'll have here, I'm sure it's going to be Gary. I'm going to show that little upstart how it's done. Oh, Gary and Blue facing each other. That's really cool. That's awesome. Okay, then I'm going to stop the episode here for now and we will get started on the Elite Four in the next episode. I'm really excited. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, but I'll try my best. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you like what you see on the channel, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time.